Hey everyone, my name is Eddie Wang and welcome back to my channel which has been out of activity uh, from about two weeks or three now and uh, I haven't really post anything uh, do with some reasons uh, first because in the past two weeks I had two tournaments to go uh, and run uh, we were invited to run a tournament on on some shopping and we did a Mortal Kombat, Mortal Kombat X tournament uh, which I came out in second place Smith took the prize and in first place he won and he got 50k from it and in the next week or the week after we had to run a Tekken 7 tournament as well and also Smith won that one and I came out in fourth place so these are the reasons why I haven't really posted anything uh, because I was grinding really hard for those tournaments and uh, it was really difficult uh, a lot of the strongest guys were there uh, but Smith took the tournament uh, the two the two tournaments and it was great guys uh, what unfortunately unfortunately happened to me was that during at some point in the event when it was my time to start playing in the Mortal Kombat event uh, my stick has fell and the restrictor gate and the switch all broke and I had to play with a regular controller for, for one day entirely in order to play uh, like uh, to play in the tournament uh, gladly when I came home in the same day I was able to partially repair my stick I took it out the, the restrictor gate and glued this the micro switch to the plate uh, and I was able to play uh, for for the day in, in Mortal Kombat just fine but still lost to Smith in the grand finals uh, where he won to Mortal Kombat but the state my stick was uh, wasn't really good to play Tekken because I couldn't access to down forward once uh, down forwards and down back uh, on the exact frame I wanted them and ended up having a lot of jabs and back moves coming out instead of the real thing so I couldn't really do electric wind hook fit so I had to play the wall Tekken 7 tournament without doing like one single electric wind hook fist launcher and for that I lost one of my of my main primary weapons machine which is launching minus 15 moves uh, with with those things and putting some fear into people with it so it was really uh, it was really unfortunate because I had him in, in, in our second game I really had him but I just really couldn't launch him because I didn't had the electric wind hook fist back then and couldn't even do anything at will so it was an uphill battle I, I, I believe I blocked about 4 death fists and couldn't really punish even one because of it uh, so it was really bad uh, but I have partially fix, fixed my stick uh, for now uh, I did some revisions and glued some some stuff back uh, it's currently working but it's not 100% uh, some things doesn't really work well sometimes the controller doesn't crouch uh, and sometimes doesn't jump and you will be seeing a lot of difference in the ways uh, I try to do some things like uh, the combos you won't see electric wind hook fist fillers uh, it's going to be pretty hard to see this you will be seeing jump forward combos as much but as you guys can see right now I'm trying to jump forward but it's only doing small jumps uh, that's because the stick still has a problem and not every button is working as intended uh, uh, it's not 100% as you guys can see there is one direction one direction that uh, it doesn't really over as much as I want so this is a problem and I can't really execute uh, proper stuff I, I like the problem being there now I can't really even do up forward two, uh, as you guys can see sometimes it misses so this is going to be a problem uh, and sometimes electrics doesn't even come out even when I want them to but is far better than what it was in the tournament because I put the receptor gate back and glued everything put all together and tied really up with some super glue that they sell often here uh, but uh, for those enthusiasts of Jin I will continue my tutorials just know that my competitive level is going to go down a little bit because I don't have a proper controller to play 
uh, on the current level that I was playing and which was launching people whenever I can in every kind of blackstone that I can uh, uh, and I have ordered parts already uh, to talk to someone to do it but it seems that I'm, I'm going to have to wait a long while so when I have an update on the stick uh, for it I will tell you guys about it and I will tell you uh, about the replacement so for now I have ordered it asking to order uh, a new a new set of micro stitch is and a new receptor a new receptor gate and receptor plate which hopefully will solve this problem for me and I will be back in full force so the video today was is not going to be only about this uh, this was just like a, a revision of the tournament I will upload the videos when I get some time to do it but there has been something that I've been talking about recently uh, and which is a low parry uh, when Jin low parries uh, stuff uh, the combo we usually go for it is this one sorry control release is failing uh, and the combo we usually go for is this one but we have been trying to get max damage from it uh, which is by doing a micro dash after the electric into back three forward uh, there was a time I was doing this but not as consistently and by the time I talked to Cherry Berry Mango about it he said yes it's possible but uh, the execution is pretty steep and it's pretty hard so you can't really use that much in combo so it doesn't really matter but still there are some people that wanted to know how we do this so I'm going to show it you have to micro dash after the electric uh, it's going to be a little bit difficult to do it but uh, you need to wait uh, you have to micro uh, the micro dash the, the uh, you have to micro dash the the, the knee the back three forward in order to connect but it's extremely difficult to do and especially with this stick uh, that is not working on full force it's going to be extremely difficult to do this uh, There you go. Uh, super, <laughs> super difficult. So this you have to micro dash, and you guys seen I attempted to do this like a lot of times, and only managed to do this like once. Uh, so it's not advisable to do this unless, of course, if the electric one hook fist didn't launch the way it launched. If it if it launched a little bit closer, it would be possible. So maybe. That's something to consider Arada in the next season to pass uh, when you buff Jin uh, give him an electric wind hook fist that l when it launches the second hit doesn't need to launch as further uh, a little bit closer will be fine so we will be able to connect back three forward just as easy and it will increase also uh, his low parry combos uh, much better than than what we currently have uh, this wouldn't be like too difficult to do uh, right now it's extremely difficult to land this but it's possible but it's just extremely difficult to do it so if there was this little buff uh, to make electric uh, launch at the same height uh, like wind hook fist launches uh, will be super good will be really good for Jin uh, we'll be able to do a lot of combos uh, without too much stress a lot of combos that we, we, we will be able to do it without too much stress like uh, those combos for example will be a lot more easier to land uh, on situations where we need them and that will be a really good buff so I will not try to extend this as much because I will try to keep this short and that's the video for today of course there is some more stuff coming and uh see you guys on the next video